your preconceptions um, are not your friends. The recreation photographs were pictures that I made um, beginning in the early 70s, really up through um, the early 90s. They came out of my excitement about making pictures, being out in the world, me being in places and situations where people were engaging with different kinds of leisure activities. But synonymously, they were also about my engagement with the pleasurable activity of making pictures. That led me into um, situations which were often unusual. I was walking um, through lower Manhattan um, in the environs of the World Trade Center towers. I came across a man who was uh, lying on a cot, must have kept this in his car. He had like an emerald Cadillac. And somehow I just had the instinct, you know, to step back. I think I made maybe two frames, maybe a little bit nervous because he had a bit of, a, you know, kind of a Jersey mobster sort of feel about the car and just like, who is this person who's got the gumption uh, to set himself up like this? There was just something kind of charmed and strange too. The first edition for Recreation was um, published in 2005. A third of the pictures are new to the publication, and I would say maybe a quarter of the pictures in the initial publication have been relinquished. So the fidelity of the images um, are, is just it's finer, it's more to my liking now. I'm a better editor, I'm better at sequencing now than I was then in, in 2005. Uh, and I think as I've gone back and remastered a project like Recreation, it's benefiting from um, the lifelong experience that I've had both as a, an image maker, but also as a bookmaker. I think one of the virtues of the way in which I've approached my practice is that I am anti-style. I think that that comes a bit out of my rebellious nature to not conform. You know, you have to locate me. I mean, I'm coming out of uh, growing up, really coming of age as a teenager in the 60s. I think I carried with me some of that um, freedom of spirit. Also, I was coming out of a very strong teaching, uh, which was uh, the, the Winogrand aesthetic of your preconceptions um, are not your friends. It's from an era where I was less self-conscious about being out in the world and making pictures. But at the same time, I think the world itself was less self-conscious. It was pre-digital. Everybody didn't have a camera, so everybody wasn't thinking about, oh, am I being photographed? Everybody wasn't paying attention to, is there a surveillance camera that's watching me now? There was something uh, more free about it. <laughs> 